Tonight we are having taco tater tot casserole. This is it. In a massive skillet, you are going to place a pound of ground beef. Mine is in a bag. Brown up your beef. Chop it up aggressively. My ground beef is quite lean, so I am not draining it. I don't know, I must have bought very lean meat this time. But I will add a metric ton of garlic. Mm. Two metric tons. To those of you who look at this and say, that's so much garlic, yes and no. Minced garlic in the jar is much, much milder than real fresh garlic. I promise you, if I was using fresh garlic, I would use nowhere near this amount. I would probably use two or three cloves and that's it. I'm also going to add in some onion powder and don't be like me, don't ever season over a hot pan. It will cause you to get some condensation inside of your jar from the moisture and it will give your spices a clumping effect. Be better than me. Into our ground beef, you're going to add the equivalent of one packet of taco seasoning. I eyeball this. Looks good. I am going to add a cup of salsa, half of a small jar. I am going to add a half a cup of water. That's for your taco seasoning. Add in one can of black beans, drained and rinsed. I have decided it needs the rest of the jar of salsa. It can't hurt anything, right? I'm gonna add in a bag of corn. It's frozen, it's fine. It will cook in the oven. Plus it's corn, it doesn't really need to cook much at all. To this, I am going to add a good handful of cheese, probably a cup, that much. I am now going to top this mixture with a bag of tater tots. Not cooked, they're frozen. You can turn off the heat at this point. It's important that they're arranged into a design. Don't just dump them on. That is chaotic and crazy. It takes an entire bag of tater tots to do this. A two pound bag. Pop this into a 350 degree oven until the top is a little bit crispy and a little bit brown. Then we are going to add cheese to the top. It's been about 20 minutes. I am going to top my casserole with some cheese. Why? Because I live in the Midwest. Looks great. Let's pop it back in the oven until the cheese is golden brown and bubbly. Here it is. This is dinner. This is one of the only ways that my husband will eat tater tots, which I realize is a weird problem to have, but Let's try it because I know what you're thinking. Is it even good? It's hot. I think you did hot spicy things. Mm -mm. It's not spicy, it's temperature hot. Of course it's good, I made it. This is delicious, make this. Follow along for more aggressive tutorials.